Hello, I'm David Noten, and I'm here to help you get the most from your Canon Pixma Pro printer. Let's look at the image color space first. Standard screens can only display sRGB colors, but professional cameras can take images in a much larger color space. Images with Adobe RGB color space get the most performance from the Pixma Pro printers. The best print quality can be achieved by shooting in raw photo film mode and converting to a 16-bit TIFF file. 16-bit per channel images offer much smoother color gradation. Don't worry if you only have JPEG images. You can still print them using Pixma Pro and achieve stunning results. Let's start up Print Studio Pro. After you open your image in Photoshop, you go to File, Automate, and there you will find the Canon Print Studio Pro. In Lightroom, you go to File and select Plugin Extras. With the live preview of Print Studio Pro, what you see in terms of borders, image position, image colors, and the rest is exactly what you get on paper. You've got tools to crop. Even thumbnails are handy when you're printing a batch. And image settings for size, paper, borders, color management, and more. You can even save your settings as profiles for easy setup next time. Let's print an image. From the media type of the plugin, select the paper type. If this is Canon paper, you'll find its exact name on the list. Select your paper size. Select paper source. Standard weight and thickness photo papers go in the automatic rear tray, where you can load multiple sheets at once. Heavier and thicker papers go into the manual feeder located at the back of the printer. It offers a less curved paper path and takes a single sheet at a time. Choose picture layout. Now the color management part. Select use ICC profile and find the correct profile for your paper from the list of the installed profiles. You can add more profiles by downloading them from the paper manufacturer's websites. For Canon papers, you can leave the ICC profile in auto. The last thing you need for color matching is select the color rendering intent. When you want to print in colors that are closer to the original image, then select relative color metric. If you want prints that look close to those on the monitor, hit perceptual. Now you're ready to hit print. A few top tips for you. Want to print a mono image? You can print using the correct ICC profile, same as a color photo, or you can opt for the black and white mode. This option can make your photos look more natural. Then there's Chroma Optimizer setting for the Canon Pixma Pro 10 and Pro 1 printers. As default, it will only be applied on top of the areas covered with color inks, but you can choose to cover the entire page, even the areas without ink. By using the pattern print function in Print Studio Pro, you can print multiple thumbnails of an image with varying color tones or brightness and contrast. You can then perform precise color adjustments simply by entering the values of the preferred thumbnail. That's just about everything, I think. If you have any more printing queries, you can always visit the Pixma Pro section on the Canon website. So why not give it a go? Printing is, after all, great fun.